quite a long time ago. Um, but we were talking the other evening about a, a major international event that took place at the turn of the century in 2000, something, something that shocked the world. This poem might have nothing to do with that. It's called The Towering Temples of the Western Sky. The time of weeks are up with him. She is high. Will it be life? Will it be death? Is there a God to go to? Is there life to give? If we are quick, no. There is a speed, yet not a hurry. In the years of a thousand deaths, the great pagan writes, no ceremony or truth, and Christians will not know. Not know till they awaken on this pagan hour. She joins the queue, and the sun shines out over the temples as she marches forth up a thousand steps. Her breasts are dry and her sex flowed out. As unscented, she worships God. Aye, the loving act was committed. The eager priest weighs her back, her legs apart. She sweats into the heat of the day, her muscles hard with fear. The fear is rejoiced in her relief. A priest now prays, and the antonym goes on. The clean white of virgin, the white of the ward, the shine of silver and light, they stand over her with a sacrificial knife, ready in light to strike the person from the bosom of life. The thought of death, the knife comes down, the worry of health, the knife goes to crown. Her virgin bleeds. For the first time, her eyes are closed, her body white, and she lives to make another mistake. Colin O'Keenan.